boost? Hey guys, welcome back to Skyrim. This is Caffeine Gaming, and we are currently working on hard answers. Uh, basically, Carlia is not actually the bad person that Mercer made her out to be, and so she poisoned us, and then Mercer tried to kill us. Well, she poisoned us to save us, and then Mercer tried to kill us. So we are going to get a journal de decoded. And the journal should have the information that explains why Mercer is a bad guy. So let's do this. Yes, yes. What is it? I've been sent by Carlia. Carlia? Then she's finally found it. Do you have Gallus's journal? Uh, how do you know about this? Yes, but there's a problem. Problem? Let me see it. Oh, this is just like Gallus. A dear friend, but always too clever for his own good. He's written all of the text in the Falmer language. He knew the Falmer language? Can you translate it? No. However, I know someone who might. The court wizard of Markarth, Calselmo, may have the materials you need to get this journal translated. Word of warning. Calselmo is a fierce guardian of his research. Getting the information won't be easy. Okay, so, um, so why did he scribe his journal in Falmer? Besides the fact that there are only a handful of people in Tamriel that even recognize the language, I'm fairly certain he was planning some sort of a heist that involved a deep understanding of the Falmer language. Sadly, we never had the opportunity to speak about the details. Uh, where did he acquire the knowledge to use it? Ironically, I pointed him in the same direction I pointed you, to Markarth. Calselmo. I'm only hoping whatever means he used to learn the language will still be available to you. All right, so. Calselmo is stubborn as a mule. Be careful when you speak to him. Yep, so now we have to go get these things that we need to translate the language. And we have to go to Markarth for that. Now, we're currently in Winterhold, so we're just going to teleport down to Markarth because it's a long walk otherwise. What the hell just happened? Okay, well we're here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if you recall, there's like a bunch of stuff going on in Markarth. No. Anyone seen entering or leaving? Strange lights or unusual noises. We're gonna stop here for a second. It's abandoned, and it's always been abandoned. Excuse me. Do you know anything about this house? Seen anyone enter or leave? Uh, no, I haven't. Seems no one in this city has. I'm with the Vigil of Stendar. We believe this house might have been used for Daedra worship. Evil rites and so forth. Do you need any help? I was actually just about to head on inside. Be good to have someone watch my back. Follow me and keep your eyes open. Daedra are powerful creatures and tricksters. You never know what you'll find. Okay, so we're not going to go in here, but um, yeah, the House of Horrors is a Daedra quest. You can follow the Mr. S Mr. Dude in there and um, start a fun quest. Actually, it's one of my favorite quests. Kind of dark though, but we're not going in there. We're heading into Understone Keep, which we've apparently never been to. Okay, so we got a bunch of stuff going on here. There is a whole set of quests, I think, that happen in here and um, we're not... We're not even going to address that at the moment. These are not real, they are statues. This is a dog. Drop back down here. I think he actually might be down here. What's up, buddy? I think I'm going the wrong direction. You have to see the yard. No sudden moves, understand? Okay, I think we're I think we're finally on the right path. I don't know where I was going. Anyway, those are statues. And um oh, I thought we were talking. We have to talk to this alchemy Look, I'm very arcane busy, enchanter. So this better be important. Yes. What are you doing here? The excavation site is closed. I don't need any more workers or guards. Um, I was looking for you, actually. 
Oh, wait, whoops. Share? Well, I guess we're doing first the one first. Underneath Markarth, the wealth of artifacts that I've based two human lifetimes of research on? Aha. Uh -huh. You idiot! Do you even know who I am? The most recognized scholar on the Dwemer in all of Tamriel. And you people keep bothering me. I... I'm sorry, I... I got too excited. I'm in the middle of some very stressful work. And I, and I shouldn't have yelled. How can I help you? Um, I hear you're the expert on ancient Falmer. Then you were well informed. I am at this very moment on the cusp of completing my magnum opus on the subject. I'm calling it Calselmo's Guide to the Falmer Tongue. It will revolutionize the way we understand those ancient beings. Perhaps I could view your work? Preposterous. That research represents years of personal toil in some of the most dangerous Dwemer ruins in Skyrim. You must be mad to think I'd allow anyone to see it before it's completed. Um, but I'm a great admirer of your work. While I appreciate the sentiment, I still have to decline. Being an admirer, I'm sure you can appreciate the need to keep my research a secret. Okay, I'll come back later. Very well. Perhaps when my research is complete, I'll feel more comfortable discussing my findings with you. Okay, so we um, we tried to get the information that we needed. He's not really willing to give that to us. So there's a couple things that we can do now. And uh, the first is there's a key right here. Can you stop moving for like a second? Okay, so we got the key. Um, we're just gonna take the key. <laughs> And we're going to be breaking into the museum at this point. I need to leave Lydia behind on this one. We're not going to be fighting our way out. Would you just come here? You know what? Let's bring you with us. It'll make this so much more interesting. Now, we do need to get in here. And uh, it's actually just an adept lock. No big deal. All right. We got a lot going on here, so let's be absolutely careful. Uh, I do have some invisibility potions. Okay, um... Shush, shush, come along. So I'm just going to kind of ignore the workers for right now and just kind of sneak in here. We should be okay getting past them. Okay, now we have a whole set of new issues here. So let's do a little bit of creeping and check it around here. There should be traps pretty much everywhere. We got guards. <laughs> I think oh, I don't have a lot of potions left. Lydia. I'm gone. Alright, so that's a problem. Um, I'm not going to really remotely, like, touch on that for right now. It sounds like Lydia may have actually killed the wizard. I don't know what's going on. Is this even where I want to be? I don't think this is where I want to be.
But there's a bunch of stuff in here that I do want to open. I am not really that big of a thief right now. Like, I'm more of just doing the, the, the job. What's in here, though? Dwarves. Th this isn't really what we need, but I'm taking them anyway. Ooh, key. Useful. Also very random. Scrolls. That we can't sell at any merchant. We have to actually pawn them. Or not pawn them. Uh, yeah, we'll go with pawn. We have to fence them. That's the word I was looking for. No, no you're not. But good try. Um, ah! I did nothing! Well, I guess... I guess we've gone from this to that, so let's, um... Let's hurry. You know what? I've got things to do. Just go, go, go. Don't worry about it. You'll be fine. We will be absolutely fine. Ow! What in the- Boost? Sorry, Lydia. to die here. Trying not to die. For the record, they are looking for me like crazy. They have slightly botched this job. Slightly. And I think we have a huge bounty on our heads now. Oh, we have five. Never mind. It's just Lydia. I'm blaming this on you, Lydia. Pretty sure they were looking for you more than they were looking for me. Alright, let's go. Don't screw this up, okay? Okay, so, uh, we need, we need to duplicate this, but we need some stuff to do so. So let's see if we can't find some materials. I think we need some charcoal and a roll of paper to do this. What is this? It's just a really shiny roll of paper. I see. Uh, but you can kind of see that they've kind of got a hint in this room. Oh my god, Lydia. Startled the crap out of me. Okay. Let's get the... Let's get this. We got problems. Just going to ignore everything that's happening in here and we're just gonna move on bye the commentary on this one is kind of uh kind of light because i'm nervous all right we have kind of oh wow you can definitely see everything from up here we've kind of escaped we need to officially escape this nonsense now one of the ways we can do this actually is if you head around this corner there's a little waterfall here this is don't hurt yourself. And if we jump in the waterfall, there's water down here, and yeah, we escaped. Look at that. Now we did, um, we did get a little bit tagged with like the five, what was it, the whole five gold that we owe, but we should be okay. Now, um, we need to head back to 
winter hold, I'm just going to go and get that done. I'm not going to really worry about walking between cities. I've talked about this before. I don't care how many colleges they build or how much the sea swallows up. I'll outlast we don't get many them all. People like you visiting okay. Well, um, I need. Where the heck? If there's anything you need. No, uh, just looking for a person. There we go. Oh, look who is here. Hi. Was there something uh, here else? you go. I suppose it would be inappropriate of me to ask how you obtained this, so I simply won't. A rubbing, eh? Odd. I expected notes. It's quite the tale. I understand. Now, let me take a good look at this. Over here, please. Okay. He just like plops everything down. Hmm. This is intriguing, but highly disturbing. It appears that Gallus had suspicions about Mercer Frey's allegiance to the guild for months. Gallus had begun to uncover what he calls an unduly lavish lifestyle replete with spending vast amounts of gold on personal pleasures. Does the journal say where this wealth came from? Yes, Gallus seems certain that Mercer had been removing funds from the guild's treasury without anyone's knowledge. Anything else, Enther? Anything about the Nightingales? Uh, yes, here it is. The last few pages seem to describe the failure of the Nightingales, although it doesn't go into great detail. Gallus also repeatedly mentions his strong belief that Mercer desecrated heck? something known as the Twilight Sepulcher. Shadows preserve us. So it's true. Your eyebrows are a fun I'm shape. Not familiar with the Twilight Sepulcher. What is it? What's, what's Mercer Frey done? I'm sorry, Anther. I can't say. All that matters is we deliver your translation to the Guild immediately. Farewell, Anther. Words can't express. It's all right, Carlia. You don't have to say a word. Can I have this back? Apparently not. Hey, what's up? Listen, all I want is the truth to be revealed to the guild. They respected Carlia, and she deserves better. Do whatever you can, and I'd consider it a personal favor. Uh, thanks. If trying to rid yourself of stolen goods becomes a burden and you find yourself in Witterhold, visit me at the college. I've been known to handle items of questionable interest from time to time, and I'll see what I can do. Okay, so at this point, I th actually think Was there something um, if you go to the college later, if you have further need of me, he will. Uh, he'll be our fence college. here. We must hasten to Riften before Mercer can do So what's this? Killed. Twilight Sepulcher. You've come this far, so I see no harm in concealing it any longer. The Twilight Sepulchre is the temple to Nocturnal. It's what the Nightingales are sworn to protect with their lives. So why? Everything that represents Nocturnal's influence is contained within the walls of the Sepulchre. Now it seems Mercer's broken his oath with Nocturnal and defiled the very thing he swore to protect. It's thieves and temples, it doesn't add up. I felt the same way when Gallus first revealed these things to me. I think given time, you'll understand what I mean. Okay, sure. As a nightingale, I've been sworn to secrecy regarding the sepulchre. I know the guild doesn't do much to foster faith, but I'm going to have to ask that you continue to trust me. All right, let's do it for your, let's do it your way. I'll make for Riften and scout the situation. See if I can discover what Mercer's up to. When you're ready, meet me at the Ragged Flagon. In the meantime, I wanted you to have this. It belonged to Gallus, but given the circumstances, I think he'd approve. All right, I'll put it to good use. If the guild isn't willing to listen to reason, you might have to. All right, so I got a nightingale blade. I'm assuming. What the? What just happened? I don't even know. All right, so um, we've got a new thing here. Uh, we need to make our way back down to the guild. So, Let's, just... what is going on? Lydia, get out of my way. <laughs> Uh, 
Get out, get out. This place is haunted. Why are you still standing here? I don't care how many call. You know, Winterhold used to What is wrong with you? Power in Skyrim. Okay. <laughs> let's um, now that we've escaped whatever the heck that was all about, let's go to weapons and take a look at the Nightingale Blade. Absorb five points of health and five points of stamina per second from the target. It's better than what we currently have by like a lot. Actually, it does less damage, but the absorb part is far better. And I do like that. It is a little bit of a shorter blade, I think. But I don't, I don't know. I don't care. This is such a good blade. Let's head back down to Riften. Yeah, we're gonna be bouncing around cities for a while here. So let's, let's bounce. All right. Now we need to go. You could say yes, we need to go to the, to the route way actually. And that's exactly what we're going to be doing. So I'm just gonna meet you at the Ragged Flagon. Um, I think that's gonna be the easiest thing. The Ratway shouldn't have anything in it, but uh, I guess that might... Yeah, we'll be fine. Not that that was a very long walk or anything. I'm glad you're here. I think some of these people are beginning to suspect oh, really? who I am. Are you ready to visit? Let's do this. What if Mercer's there? Then we show them Gallus's journal and hope for the best. Remember, we have proof that all he's got is his word. All right, let's go. Keep your eyes open. I'm not sure what to expect when we enter the system. Doom, probably. Even if you're one of us. Like how everybody just kind of ignores you. So, you're bringing your Thing, Things are different. All right, let's... Like wait, do I actually have to wait for Carlia? Okay, good. She's on the way. Oh boy. Carlia! Carlia! You better have a damn good reason to be here for that murder. Please, lower your weapon so we can speak. I have proof that you've all been misled. No tricks, Carlia, or I'll cut you down where you stand. Now, what's this so called proof you speak of? I have Dallas's journal. I think you'll find its contents disturbed. Let me see. No, it can't be. This can't be true. I've known Mercer too long. It's true, Brynjolf. Every word. Mercer's been stealing from the guild for years. Right under your noses. There's only one way to find out if what the last says is true. Delvin, I'll need you to open the vault. Why, just a blessed moment. What's in that book? What did he say? It says Mercer's been stealing from our vault for years. Gallus was looking into it before he was murdered. Man, if Mercer up now with all it needs two keys, it's impossible. Can he pick his way in? That door has the best puzzle locks money can buy. There's no way it can be picked. Yeah, there's no way. You didn't need to pick it. What's she on the bell? Use your key on the vault, down. We'll open it up and find out the truth. All right, let's uh, let's watch this. I've used my key, but the vault's still locked up tight out of the drum. Now you. Okay, so it has two keys. Because it's totally not something you can pick. Nope. What happened? Wow, this is, uh, there's some steel battle weapons over here. The gold, it's yours. It's all gone. Get him, Bex. I'll kill him. Bex, put it away, right now. We can't afford to lose our heads. We need to calm down and focus. Do what he says, Bex. This ain't helping right now. We do it your way. For now. Delvin, Vex, watch the flagon. If you see Mercer, come tell me right away. Okay, um... Okay, what's up? Look, before I help you track Mercer down, I need to know what you learned from Kailaya. I mean, everything. Uh, let's see. Mercer killed Gallus, not Carlia. 
feared that was the case. From that last entry in Gallus' diary, it looks like he was getting close to exposing Mercer to the guild. Anything um, else? Carlia was between Golden Glow and Hunting Brew. Trying to make Mercer look bad in front of Maven, eh? Clever lass. They're it's Nightingales. Else. What? Nightingales? But I always assumed they were just a tale. A way to keep the young footpaths in line. Was there anything no, else that's she it. told you? Then I have an important task for you. I need you to break into Mercer's home and search for anything that could tell us where he's He has a house in Riften? Aye. A gift from the Black Briars after they kicked the previous family out. A place called Rift Wheeled Manor. He never stays there. Just pays for the upkeep on it. Hired some lout by the name of Bold to guard I'll the I'll take place. care of it. Be careful, lass. This is the last place in Skyrim I'd ever want to send you. Just find a way in. Get the information and leave. And you have permission to kill Fantastic. anyone that stands in your way. Uh, what's the best way to get in? Good question. I've only set foot inside a few times myself. And that was in Mercer's company. If you can get past his trained watchdog, I think your best bet might be the ramp to the second floor balcony in his back. I don't suppose the ramp is easy to access. No. It's some sort of crazy contraption Mercer commissioned for quick escapes. I'd wager a well-placed shot at the ramp's mechanism with lure it in hurry. Uh, you mentioned a watchdog? <laughs> That'd be bald. A real piece of work, that one. Mercer's holding something over his head, keeping him loyal. Talk to Vex. She used to know him very well. Okay. Catch my meaning. Uh, what's missing from the vault? Better question would be, what did he leave? Mercer took everything, even all of our plans. Plans are gone. for what? Before Mercer took over, Gallus started collecting every bit of material he could on locations ah. the guild could heist. Museums, keeps, estates, you name it. By the time Mercer took over the guild, we must have had a few dozen. How could he have opened the vault door alone? I don't have a clue. That door is impenetrable. Without two keys, it's impossible to open. I have a key, Delvin has a key, and Mercer has a key. That's it. There are no other copies. All right, sounds good. Careful at Mercer's place. I don't want to lose anyone. All right, so we out. are going to be working on the pursuit. We need to talk to Vex about Vald, so we're gonna do that, and then, um, get, I don't know, head to Mercer's house, and I don't know, start getting all the stuff that we need from him. I guess I'm bringing Lydia along with us. Anyway, thank you all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this little episode, and I will see you guys next time.